The robotic spine surgery is one of those things that there's probably a lot of misconceptions about. A lot of people, when they hear about robotic spine surgery, they have this idea that the surgeon is sitting at home or sitting on a beach controlling a computer or joysticks or just sitting in the corner of the room and not actually touching the patient, not anywhere near the patient and just controlling the robotic function from afar. I think the coolest part about robotic spine surgery is that it allows the surgeon to interact and do surgery as we have in the past, but it just makes it more efficient, more effective, less disruptive for the patient. Surgery times are cut down tremendously. Blood loss is less, pain is less, and recovery is faster. The way that this robot works is that it actually interprets each patient's individual anatomy. Whereas in the past, what we would rely on is super grainy, poor quality x-rays that are taken in the operating room. You know, I always equate it to airline pilots these days could fly in plane on their own, but they're gonna put it on autopilot because that's the safest, most efficient way to fly people. Same thing with GPS. This is what the robot does. It's individualized GPS for each patient. And it allows me to do the same surgery that we used to do through a eight inch incision. Now I can do it through a two inch incision. And the previous way of doing these surgeries would be fairly brutal, which increased the recovery time because you had to take all the muscles and strip them off of the spine in order to visualize the anatomy. This robotic system allows me to do this through small incisions and actually just split the muscle and it's way less brutal. The patients are back on their feet so much quicker and I've had a great patient experience with this.